Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title of today's video, I am going to be doing a bridal gown and bridesmaid dress try on haul. So the company JJ's house was nice enough to send me a few bridesmaids dresses as well as one bridal gown for fun. And I feel like right now is just bridal season. Like everyone's getting married. I have to find stuff to wear. So I was super excited that they reached out because the dresses are fantastic quality and not super expensive. So I'm going to do this video so that you can see the quality of the dresses as well as what they're priced at because it is definitely possible to find reasonably inexpensive dresses that are super good quality. So with that, let's get into it. Okay, so this is the first dress that they sent me and I am not even going to try to say the name because all of the names for the dresses are really long, but this is a mermaid and scoop neck dress and it has a slit in the front. Super cute. My initial reaction is that the quality is fantastic. It has this really cute open back as well and I won't be able to get this all in the frame, but once I try it on, you'll be able to see that there is a slit in the front too. So really love this dress. All of the dresses that they have come in a million different colors. So if you didn't like red, you could get this in a different color as well. So going to try this dress on and show you how it looks. I think my favorite part about JJ's house is the fact that they actually will customize the dresses to your size. I am super short. Whenever I buy dresses, they are always literally a foot and a half too long. And so there's the option actually to put in all of your measurements. So I took every single one of my measurements, it's super easy. They tell you how to do it and you send them to them. So every single one of these dresses is customized to my exact size, to my height, to my waist, to my bust. So I just think honestly, that's amazing, especially for a company where the dresses aren't that expensive. So this is a price point at $131. And it's custom to my size, which is unheard of. So really, really impressed with that as well. So I'm going to try this on for you. Okay, guys, so this is the red dress here. And as you can see, I feel like it fits perfectly. Obviously, I gave them my measurements and they did a phenomenal job. It lays extremely nicely. The one thing I will say is there's an under part of the dress underneath the main dress here, like a slip that can bunch a little bit, but if you make sure that that is setting down, I think the dress fits super nicely and lays flat against your body. The bust feels really good, it's super comfortable. It's cinched in up here. I love this slit, I feel like it adds a lot to the dress. This is the one dress that I actually did leave the train on, so there is a lot of extra material below here. Honestly, I probably should have pulled the train off of this one as well. I wanted to leave the train on at least one so that I could experience what that looked like, but it makes it a little bit more challenging to wear. So unfortunately, I would probably have to pull the train off of this myself or go get it done in order to wear this dress because I love the style of this dress plain, but it's going to be hard for the train following me to actually wear this dress. But I can definitely get that fixed and overall, the rest of the dress is stunning. So I'll turn around so that you can see the back as well. Obviously there is the open back here, which I think is super flattering and really nice. And it makes the dress just a little bit different. So the front obviously is super sleek, classy, and plain. And then this is super fun as well. So overall, extremely happy with this dress. I love this slit. Like I said, the one thing that I would fix would be the train, which I could have done, but wanted to leave it just so that I had an idea of what a dress with a train was like from their store. And I actually love it. I mean, the material is phenomenal. Obviously it's beautiful. If you could walk around with a train like this, I would not be able to do so, but love it. And again, this dress is only $130. So I feel like for the price, for the quality, for it being custom, that's a steal. Okay, so moving on to dress number two, which is literally my favorite dress. I am so obsessed with this. I wasn't sure that I would love velvet. I was so wrong. This is stunning. Obviously, it's an off-the-shoulder dress. It has a slit in the front as well, which you'll see when I try it on. The quality is phenomenal. You can tell really in the zippers too because it's a super sturdy zipper. The length is perfect because it's custom for me. Um, so if anyone wants to take me to a super nice ball gown style party, I'm ready to go because this is absolutely amazing. I love this dress. When it came in the mail, it was totally 
wrinkle free. I think that's obviously a positive with the velvet. I will say the other dresses I did have to steam, which is the same for any dress you're going to buy, most likely depending on the fabric that you have. So cannot say enough good things about this dress. So let's try it on. Okay, so this is probably my favorite dress of all time. Had I known that this site existed circa prom when I was in high school or for any form of sorority formal, I would have bought this dress. I am so unbelievably impressed with the quality and the fit especially with an off the shoulder gown, it can be really hard to get the fit right, especially because you have to make sure that it's not falling down, right? You have to make sure that it's holding up in the back. I can't say enough good things about this dress. The quality is phenomenal. It's obviously very soft because it's a velvet. The slit is so sexy, so cute. As someone needs to have a black tie wedding because I'm ready to wear this dress. Also for $124, this is a total steal, and I feel like I'm saying that for a lot of them, but especially when the company is willing to make the dress to your size, that was so huge for me because I hate to get a dress like this and have to worry about the length and have to worry about fixing it. It's a whole nother can of worms. They got it to me so fast. I ordered it came within two weeks max, and that's a custom dress. I mean, usually that takes four to six weeks at least. And this is actually the one of the ones that had a train, but I did without a train. And I'm so happy that I did because it sits on the floor perfectly. So it sits right at the bottom of my heel. The best part too, is you can tell them exactly what heel you're wearing or give an approximation of how tall you think the heels will be so that they can fit the dress to that. Because I knew I wasn't going to wear flats with this. So doing my normal height would have not worked. So overall, I mean, like I said, favorite dress. It fits super snug. It's so sexy. I love this dress. So I felt like to get the full experience of JJ's house, I had to also get a wedding gown. So absurd because I won't be wearing this, but had to try it out. And honestly, the quality for the price is fantastic. So this dress is $173. When it came, it was super wrinkly. Obviously, they're stuck in the box, so had to steam it, of course. But this dress is beautiful. The material is so soft. It's a beautiful color as well. You can see the back here has this scoop neck, which will be more obvious when I try it on. And then all the way down are these small buttons. So just beautiful in the detail. Like I said, especially for $173, like a really couldn't ask for more in a dress. So going to try this on, it does look a little bit bigger than the other one, so not sure in terms of the fit. Like I said, I put all of my measurements, so you know, if I put something wrong or I put something that was a little bit too big or there was a dress that's a little stretchier, that'll be my fault. <laughs> so everything looks like it's going to fit super well. Let's try it on. Okay, so as I said before, I had to try at least one bridal gown. So this one I chose because I thought it looked really sleek and beautiful online. I actually, when I was looking through these dresses, and I suggest doing this whenever you're online shopping, is looking at the reviews and for any pictures. Because really those photos are going to show you what the dresses actually look like for bathing suits or any form of clothes. So I looked at those. And it looked pretty good quality. So I would say overall, the material is great. It's sturdy. It runs about $173. So I mean, for a wedding dress, when you think about, I don't know, I'm used to say yes to the dress when they're like, this dress is $6,800. So $173, I would say quality wise is great. I feel like it doesn't really do my frame justice. I don't know if it's because it doesn't fit quite right or if it's just the material doesn't look quite right, but I don't love it. I will say that there are nice details. So the sleeves buttoned down here as well, which did take a really long time. I understand if you're getting married that that's not the end of the world. Obviously you want everything to be perfect, but each of these buttons you have to individually do. On the caveat to that, they have the exact same buttons down the entire dress, which is gorgeous. So it flows all the way down. Obviously, this one has a train as well. But if you can see the buttons down the back, these buttons actually have a zipper. So the nice part is that I did not have to do all of those buttons. It zipped down, 
So I like this dress. I don't love it. I would say for the price, the quality is great. The sleeves are a little bit baggy on me. The back is really pretty though. I would say the back's my favorite part of the dress. It has this scoop here, which is super nice. It's steamed out extremely well. I think it's more flattering from the back, in my opinion, than the front. Thick material, so, I mean, you can tell the quality of this is actually significant because this is a lot of dress. <laughs> like, we've got a lot going on here. <laughs> Overall, not my favorite. Won't be wearing this to my wedding. <laughs> don't have a wedding coming up. So like I said, just wanted to try on a bridal gown so I could get an idea. I think I probably should have chosen a slightly different one, but I wanted to try this because I thought it looked really sleek. So not my favorite, but the quality is there for the price for sure. Okay, so final dress here. And just to note, every single one of these dresses was in the 100 to 200 range, which for bridal gowns and bridesmaids dresses is absurd. And I will say that also, you're not lacking on the quality as well because sometimes when you spend not enough money, you get what you pay for. I would say this is not one of those situations. I really feel like the dresses are holding up. They're super sturdy and they're great quality, especially given the price. So this is the last dress here, which is this stunning plum colored gown. The best part I think about JJ's is the customizability. So there were a couple dresses that actually came with trains that I knew I didn't want a train on because I didn't want to step on it. I didn't want it behind me, especially if you're wearing a bridesmaid's dress, having a train just seems absurd or a dress anywhere. It's just hard. It gets stepped on. It's the worst. So for a couple of them, I actually asked if they could do it without a train and they did, which was phenomenal. So I believe this is one of the ones that I asked without a train. The back is stunning. It's a low cut back with these super cute, crystal design here and it goes all the way down as well so these are all full length dresses so going to try this one on as well but like i said the customizability is phenomenal and they did such a good job on all of these so last but definitely not least is this burgundy dress that i got this one was priced at 147 so it was actually the highest priced dress out of all of them i would say overall i think this dress actually fits the best Aside from the velvet dress, that one fit perfectly. I would say this is definitely the next best. It's stunning. I love the back of the dress. It's a low back here. And I was a little concerned about the crystals looking cheap. I will say the only part I noticed that doesn't look super, super high quality would be up here. But honestly, overall, if you look from afar or even really up close, everything is tailored down. So. I think it's beautiful. I really like how this dress lays. Like I said, fits perfectly. I think they did a fantastic job. There's a little bit of a train on the dress, not super long, but definitely long enough to where someone could step on it. So might be an issue, but I have a pretty high heel on. I have probably like a six inch heel. So I don't know that I could go any taller. <laughs> I would probably have to have this a little bit if I wanted to wear it out and about, but it cinches really nicely at the waist. And something about a backless dress is sometimes it's hard for it to sit really flat, but I feel like this one does a fantastic job doing just that. I don't feel like this is going to fall off my shoulders, and I feel like it just gives a really, really nice hourglass shape. So, love this dress as well. I will say, obviously, this is the most expensive one, but only at $147, so still really inexpensive given the quality of the material as well. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed some of these dresses. I know I did. If you are interested and want to go see some of the other dresses, JJ's house has all sorts of dresses. They have evening dresses, bridal dresses, prom dresses, you name it. So I really recommend going to the site. I will link it below. And if you find something that you like, you can use code Madison for 10% off. So these dresses are already, in my opinion, super discounted. So even better, go ahead and go check them out. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions about the dresses, about the fit, let me know and I'll answer them below. See you next video.